These days, Japanese girls mm -hmm. have bigger boobs. Like some random people sometimes like misunderstand that I'm a pregnant. Like they asked me if Japanese guys would love to lick ours. <laughs> they they tweeted on their Twitter like, oh my god, I can die for this anime or something. Hey guys and girls, it's Kathy Cat and today I'm joined by my friend Hiroko from Hiroko TV. <laughs> yes, Yay. and today we are going to play another game of the Japanese girl Mythbusters. I picked up some Japanese girl myths on the internet and I would like you to tell me whether they are true or wrong in your opinion. So let's start! Yay, let's start! <laughs> Japanese girls are all very shy. Ah! Mm. Well, it's kind of true, I think. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah. Because they, so that one is actually true. It is true. I mean, like it's also changing and it depends on person for of course. So not mm -hmm. everyone is too shy, mm -hmm. but um, I also feel like when I speak in Japanese, I feel more shy. Ah, mm. so you, your personality changes when you speak in Japanese. Is this because the language is also like changing for between girls and boys? Um, and also like the way we talk grammatically mm -hmm. because we don't tell people from the result when we speak in Japanese, right? In English, let's say, hey, I can't come to the party, sorry, because my, my wife is pregnant in English. Mm -hmm. But let's mm -hmm. say in Japanese, hey, I, I would really, really love to join your party. It sounds amazing, but I'm afraid I might not able to come because my wife ah. is pregnant. This is Japanese very, very way, yeah, yeah. Way. But please invite me again. That's another thing yeah, I, I got told yeah, yeah. to like, always admin. So please invite tricky, me again. It's so tricky, you know. <laughs> Did he mean that or not? It's so tricky. Um, coming back to Japanese girls, mm -hmm. so how do you think they are more shy compared to, for example, some of your friends from other countries? Um, I found out about that when we were, you know, drinking together, when I was doing girls' night, and I was mm -hmm. talking to Swedish girls, and me as a Japanese girl and some other girls from other countries and we were talking about love life mm, and they, yes. they asked me about hey how about love life with Japanese boys but I couldn't really tell them to me they were really really aggressive like ah that's very forward that kind of talk right yeah, yeah. Or like they were aggressive in their stories as yeah, well yeah on their stories I mean no 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 talking about that is not aggressive to me it's just fun mm -hmm. but when it comes mm -hmm. to like uh, how much details should I just tell you, though? Uh. Because, you know, like, they asked me if Japanese guys would love to lick ours. <laughs> I'm not sure if we can put that in, but keep talking. <laughs> we, we, we wouldn't say that, hey, please do this, do that to our partners. Japanese girls can't really say that. We, we, we could if we want, but we, mm. we feel shy, so I, I wouldn't say that, like, I, I would say that in my brain, like, go down, go down, go down, or like, you know, please do this next, mm -hmm. but I, oh, please don't stop. I can't just say that to my partner. Uh, so I'm always just wishing that he wouldn't, you know, stop or, but, yeah. I think that that's a difficult one, though, but it's, it's one thing between male pride of their pride getting hurt when, he is, when you're telling them, can you please do this? Because then they feel like they might have done something wrong. Uh, and the other part is... The, uh, you know, that, that, that there's male pride there, you don't want to hurt that person's pride, but at the same time, mm -hmm. if, they're not, don't, if they don't know what they're doing, then, you know, uh, it's, not, it's not a bad thing of telling them, hey, oh. I, I prefer it a little bit more like that. I mean, like, it's always nice to tell what we like, truly, I think. Mm -hmm. It's not about, you know, they're doing bad job or something. They're doing great, yeah. but, like, they also ask girls, like, hey, how do you want it to be done, or, you know, like, mm -hmm. what kind of stuff do you like? But we can't really answer in general. <sighs> yeah, I would just say like, oh, that's really great. That's it. But, but I'm sorry, like, <laughs> this is totally like going really into detail now. I think this might become its own video in a way. But, <laughs> <laughs> but how, how, I think it's like both, both genders walk past each other. The boys don't know what the girls will like and the girls mm. will not be able to tell the boys mm -hmm. what they like, right? True. But it will be really too much details, but there are a few ways, I think. Yeah, but let's not... <laughs> <laughs> yeah, um, so, so Japanese girls are shy mm -mm. 
in in all areas then it seems like even when you're intimate with someone japanese girls are still very very shy i'm also shy so i was really mm. surprised that my girlfriends from abroad they would say their partners to do this and that in bedroom mm. so i was like mm. wow seriously how do you do that and they but in the way like oh. if the partner goes like oh great now i know what to do is a better like yeah, the whole like yeah i know sex life is a lot better right uh, i know but it's like i don't know why i can't just do that but after talking to the girlfriends from abroad i can't really tell my all of my ex-boyfriends but few mm -hmm. of my ex-boyfriends i could tell them um honestly hey to be honest i like this style i like this mm -hmm. and that so yeah thanks to their advices yeah because oh so you learn from the foreign girls <laughs> who voice a couple of your opinions now <laughs> yeah 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 but I, i'm not really a master of it too a little by little yeah i think that it improves like everything so be Japanese girls are so shy to almost a flaw that they can't express the things they really want in, in different mm -hmm. areas of life then. I think so. So how is that? Everyone keeps mentioning when we interview people with the uh, show time men. Mm. Like first people you meet for the first time, they're super shy with people they meet for the first time as well ah, then. I mean, well, we call that kind of people hitomisiri. Ah, mm -hmm. and like... It's a different type of shyness, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That, that kind of people also exist because i'm not at all i don't feel shy i can hug like hey nice meeting you let's have hug you know before this mm -hmm. covid 19 situation i could do that and yeah, <laughs> before that we could yeah, yeah. <laughs> so um because i'm like this my friends are really open in general mm. so we don't really feel shy but there are of course that those kind of people exist in japan so it's true yeah. We know what I find really interesting right now is mm -hmm. that you're generally one one of the more outgoing Japanese girls that I know. True. <laughs> but when it when it goes to the more private parts, mm -hmm. you are actually super shy. I didn't expect yeah, that. Yeah, I mean, like before I learned how to speak in English, how to communicate in English, I couldn't really express how I truly feel to people. Like if someone say something bad to me, I was like, mm -hmm. ah, yeah, it's okay, kind of girl before. Oh. Yeah, but mm -hmm. now if someone pisses me off, I would say like, hey, why did you do that to me? I don't like it because blah, blah, blah. If you could do this way, then I would appreciate it. Let's talk mm -hmm. about it. I can say that now, but um, deep down, true Hiroko is like, ah, should I say that? I feel shy, kind of. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's But you kind of overcoming that shy <laughs> yeah, voice. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, so what would you say like um, helped you to be a bit less shy? Was that like advice from international girls? Actually, yes. I mean, mm -hmm. when it comes, it's it's only for you know bedtime stuff though. Other oh. yeah, <laughs> other stuff. I'm not mm -hmm. really shy, you know. So I can just ask mm -hmm. boys how they feel about me, or when I need to ask them, I can just confirm them. Good. Yeah. Right. Thank you so much. <laughs> I hope. Sorry. I hope I didn't cut I think one this of your parts. itself is already. <laughs> this is already like pretty rounded for a video. <laughs> the myth is, Japanese girls all know famous characters from anime, manga, or games. True or false? False. Ah. Mm -hmm. uh, not everyone is into anime or manga. See, it seems to be that some people, especially online, seem to be thinking that mm. Japan, it is the country of anime and manga and games because this is where they're made, but that everyone is like watching and everyone is seeing it kind of thing. Mm -hmm. But it's, it's not true. Many of my girlfriends, they don't really watch anime at all. Some of the girls, party girls, would see, you know, people who would love anime or watch, uh, watch anime or love mangas like a nerd. So because I love watching anime, I love reading mangas, so they sometimes yes. call me a nerd. Ot uh, otaku, otaku. So you, <laughs> otaku yeah, is yeah, a nerd. Yeah, yeah. So the otaku image has gone a little bit better over the last years, though, hasn't it? Oh yeah, yeah, I, I agree with that. Mm -hmm. There aren't, I like, but I find it interesting, like the girls who are actually into anime and manga that you see who are very open about it, mm. tend to be the ones who 
have like their own little groups of otome stuff so actually anime <laughs> manga that they like that are aimed towards girls sort of like sexy boys and stuff so they don't necessarily watch the same stuff that a guy would be watching mm. it's kind of what i failed is that is that do you think that's like that um well i'm into animes like for guys in general though mm -hmm. because um i love let's say De demon slayers slam dunk one piece Oh, kind of. the classic. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. so, so, lots of shonen in there. Yes. Um, I'm more into, like, nerdy anime series these days. And I, I think so many of the good-looking guys, for example, mm -hmm. um, like, actor, popular actor guy, they, yes. they tweeted on their Twitter, like, oh my god, I can die for this anime or something. Mm -hmm. Sometimes. So, maybe thanks to, you know, social medias, people can know that Oh my god, my favorite prince loves anime, so maybe anime is not uncool stuff anymore or something, I think. Mm -hmm. I, I mean, So it's kind of, the image has gotten better then since mm -hmm. then. Yeah, because of people's personal tweets and, I don't know, live streaming about what they like or something, I think. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I mean, like, I've been watching anime and manga a lot, and I think in that kind of anime manga world, it, it, it's done so much good as well, like it helps people study, it's help, it helps people get motivated or get interested in like a sport or an art watching anime, so... Mm. But I'm so yeah. I was surprised when I was here how little Japanese girls, like the average Japanese girl in mm. our interviews, actually watches it or at least tells that she's watching it, you know what I mean? I think uh. a couple of people are like, no, no, I don't play games. Like, especially when you're in a group with loads of girls mm -hmm. and you're kind of like, at least that one girl over there, she might be a bit geeky. I can see a bit yeah, of geek yeah, yeah. in there. True, She'll be true. the one who's like, no, 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 no. Like, yeah. I wonder whether it, like peer pressure is also there that it's still kind of still seen as a little bit geeky for some girls and they don't dare to actually say, yes, mm. I love this. I don't know. I mean, maybe, but many of my girlfriends tell me, tells me that they are not into manga. But I'm just, you know, sending them my favorite anime series links, like uh, spam, spam. <laughs> you need yeah, to watch spam, this, spam me. <laughs> yes, oh, I, I, I send me stuff too, send yeah, me yeah, stuff yeah, yeah, right yeah. now, especially now where we're all stuck inside, it's good to, yes, to yes. find out what everyone's watching. Yeah, yeah. I mean, I'll send you my list too. Oh my god, thank you. you. My list. <laughs> yeah. So, to wrap this video up, Japanese girls are shy. True or false? True. True. Mm. In your opinion, true. Yeah. Good one. Well, we learned everything. Everyone <laughs> learned something. <laughs> Thank you so much for sharing your stories with us. And uh, don't forget to also head over to Hiroko TV to her own channel. She's doing a sh challenge right now. And even though you're shy, you're trying really, really hard. <laughs> but see, you're trying really hard to make this happen. So true. good luck. Fingers yep. crossed. Give her some extra Thank support. You. And guys, thank you all for tuning in and watching this channel. Hope you enjoyed this. There's gonna be more. So don't forget to subscribe to this channel too. And I'll catch you soon for more stuff on Ask Japanese. Bye and thank you. Bye. I mean, they are seeing the Asian girls as um, easy girls, I think. Yeah, I don't know where that image is coming from, especially with yeah. Japanese girls. I'm like, true. What?